everybody, Tanae here with the Tanae Show. I am here with a very special guest, Lavelle Smith Jr. Now, please let everybody know exactly what your, your title is and, and kind of where we are today because we're in a room right now, but we're here on a, a very special occasion. So kind of let everyone know. Yeah, well, I'm working with The Invincible Show. It's a glorious tribute to Michael Jackson and we're here. Wow. And that is amazing because, of course, I, I heard that Michael wanted to do the tour and then he passed. So you all are kind of like continuing this legacy and want everybody to just kind of get that experience. Talk about what went into doing this. Because I know this has to be hard because you've worked with him. What went into gathering all of the people, picking the people to, to do the dancing and the looks and mm -hmm. everything? Yeah, I think, you know, like I said, I worked with Michael over 23 years. And so this is just kind of a... Um, you know, I love when people pay tribute to him. He deserves it. He did so much for music and for dance. So I think this opportunity people who didn't get to see him ever in a tour, they get to experience what that might have been like. And people who saw it get to enjoy that and remember how amazing it was. Yeah, we have uh, three great tribute artists here. Um, Pete Carter, Jeffrey Perez, and Michael Mori. And I think that Darren put this all together. I think it's a labor of love for him. Okay. You know, he was a huge Michael Jackson fan himself. And so he put together all the classic songs that we know Michael for. Mm -hmm. Super Criminal, mm -hmm. Dangerous, love Beat him. It. Yeah, so it's, it's, wow. it's, a, it's just a show to see. Now, Michael Jackson is one of those people that I always said is like a freaking nature. We've never and we never will see anyone like him. I don't think we I will. mean, the, from the dancing to the personality to just the persona he was just here on this earth i think to just kind of bless us mm -hmm. and then he was just and kind of take it away yeah. yeah it's it's just so to me he just wasn't human -like. right it, it, then, but you know i think that that is such a beautiful thing you said mm -hmm. and it's true i mean that there's something very special about him mm -hmm. and I, I remember being in his presence about you know the first time when i was working with monster criminal just feeling that mm -hmm. you know when he moved i can literally feel it across the room when he's yeah. dancing it's it's amazing. it's amazing. I don't think we'll ever have that again. You know, I, I always wonder, will I ever see that happen again? Yeah. I, mean, I, I would say the closest, and he's nowhere near close, Chris Brown. Yeah. I just think the yeah. way he dances is kind of um, yeah. natural. I worked with Chris yeah. on the World Music Awards. And uh, yeah, he did a tribute to Michael. He did Thriller. Mm -hmm. And we did that in London. And yeah, he, you know, he has some of the same qualities as far as hard work. Mm -hmm. Jackson worked hard. He made it look easy, but he spent hours in the dance studio and just perfecting everything. He was not afraid to, to work hard, and he taught me that too. Now, you're the closest I say I can get to Michael. That is amazing because, like I said, it, he's, he wasn't really reachable and, and tangible. So just talk about who Michael really was who, from the perspective of what you saw. Because yeah. we all have negative mm -hmm. perceptions of yeah, him. Yeah, no, I think that... One thing that people don't really know about is the great sense of humor, love to laugh. Um, you know, our rehearsal time would be, you know, it'd be quite a long time, but within that time, we would just sometimes just sit and talk, you know, <laughs> yeah. about whatever, anything. I think there's a very intelligent man who can talk about anything mm -hmm. and do so much. Wow. I think, yeah, just an awesome person to be around. Great boss, mm -hmm. great boss, and, um, and taught me a lot about hard work and being fearless and just really embracing whatever you do, whatever it is you do. Now, does he fun. really have the soft voice? Okay. No, it's not that, um, no. Okay. No, it wasn't that soft. Okay, because no, <laughs> I just know we yeah, see it a lot and yeah, he's very... that's, you know, that's... Another position. Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah. But, um, okay. no, his voice is high, but it wasn't that high. <laughs> I got you. Now, um, list all of the people that you've worked with, because, oh I mean... Gosh. Michael, I mean, you can only go. Michael, uh, Janet, Beyonce, oh, Prince, yeah. Don Ross, Rolling Stones, Rod Stewart, TLC, Amazing. Chris Brown, Usher. So you are just the man. You man, are you know what? the I, man. I love what I do. It's a blessing to be able to, to wake up every day and love what you do and not dread going to work. And I'm not afraid of hard work. 
sorry. So how did you actually get into it? Because I'm pretty sure that's hard to tap into, especially with working with all the groups. That's what people said to me. You know, when I, I went to performing arts school. Okay. Study dance. And the teachers, that's all they said. It's really hard. It's really hard. It wasn't hard. Wow. It wasn't. I can say it's, it's I'm blessed. It's, it's, it's a blessing yeah. because it just... One thing lined up after another. Mm -hmm. By the time I was 19, I was in LA on TV. Oh, wow. Yeah, it just, it's nothing but God. I take no credit for that at all. <laughs> it, it's, it's a blessing, you know. I think when you're, he gives us all talents, you know, mm -hmm. our own talents. And I think when you embrace it mm -hmm. and you respect it, he takes you where you want to be mm -hmm. and where you need to be. Right. You know, because there are some jobs that I didn't get when I first got to LA and I thought, God, I, really, I want that job. I want that job. Mm -hmm. But then if I had taken that path, I wouldn't be, wouldn't be sitting here. here. I'm a true believer in that as well, because sometimes you can look at people and say, dang, I should have been there, or I should be here, but he has a different path. That's right, and you have to embrace that, whatever, and be open to it, mm -hmm. whatever it is. You know, you might not see it, but it's, mm -hmm. you know, I like, I, I turned 50 this this year. Oh, you don't yeah. look a day oh, over uh, 40. Let's see. And I just think he puts you where you need to be. Yeah. So That's amazing. So how... The average time, maybe in like a, a piece that you did for Michael of, um, because you said you did with Thriller and those things. No, I, I didn't um, choreograph Thriller. I choreographed Dangerous, okay. uh, Jam for the stage. Um, wow. They didn't really care about us. We did it on a tour. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but Michael taught me all the dances. Okay. So when I teach it to somebody, I'm teaching gotcha. it the way he taught me. And That's unique. Yeah, yeah, and he did that. You know, he, um, pretty much taught us the victory tour. Okay. And that's how I learned a lot of songs that mean that we stopped doing. We only did some of them on the bad tour, but he taught taught us the whole show, the whole victory tour. And you know, watching yeah, that's a master, you know, if you can Crazy. Yeah. So is there choice. any perks? Uh, you know what I got to I bought my mom a house when I was twenty one. I helped my mom get a house when I was twenty one. So amazing. that's the lesson. Wow, yeah. yeah. A lot of people cannot say that. Yeah, but actually working with him. Mm -hmm. So what's next for you? I know you have this tour. Well, you know, I do these tours all around the world, different artists in different countries. Mm -hmm. But I think right now, hopefully, I'll get my own TV show. Because I think it's going to be easier for me to touch a lot of young dancers, mm -hmm. you know, touch their minds and reach them, especially the poor ones in Brazil. That's where I'm concentrating now. Is, you know, I do a lot of stuff in Brazil. Mm -hmm. But they have a lot of Poor children that I know, if given the chance, could be great dancers. Wow. And I want to see if I can help that happen for them. That's it changes lives. And that's all you need is that platform. Mm -hmm. that, that TV yeah. platform. I'm surprised you don't have a show already. I'm I've done TV shows for other people, but this okay. is important because I want to own my own show. Yeah. I'm going to be very Oprah about it. If you don't own it, it don't matter. <laughs> I like that. Yeah, you got like to own it. You know, and I, I, like I say, I know the shows I've done all, you know, all around the world. As a guest judge, a guest mentor. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but it's that's amazing. It's better when you own it. I just yeah. know that's going to be better. I'm sure it'll be harder too, but it's yeah. okay. <laughs> you know what I'm talking about. <laughs> Along oh, yeah. Show. Um, the show is actually new, but I've been doing um, like interviews and I've had my own brand for probably about six years that's now. Awesome. I haven't young. worked with a magazine, I haven't worked with anyone, and I've interviewed everyone from God, he trained That and, is amazing. I know. That's a blessing. Yeah, it is, and it's just, I really understand what you were kind of saying about, I, you know, I wanted that, I wanted that, or they wanted mm -hmm, that, mm -hmm. but I'm like, you know what, I'm going to create my own oh, lane. That, yeah, I'm going to do one. Mm -hmm. Build your own road, yep. you know, I think there's, because there really is no set method it's not. to getting what you want. Mm -hmm. It's individual, and as different as we all are, that's how many ways to exactly. get there. Mm -hmm. So, his way or her way is not might not be our way, mm -hmm. but we'll make our own. Exactly. If I got to do this Whatever. and this, yeah. then I'm going to get there. Be fearless, be vigilant, and don't give up. Wow. And thank the haters for their hate. You know what? They are my motivators. Mine too. I, love I use them like vitamins. <laughs> you know? Yeah. I love that. Yeah. yeah, because people tell you, oh, you're not going to do this. Right. I'm going to say, okay, thank you. Watch me. Right. I so love I it. Say, watch me. Watch me. What is the best um, kind of piggybacking off that? What is the best advice you've ever received? I'm trying to think. Michael like, taught, taught me to be open mm -hmm. and be, no, no, there's no boundaries as mm -hmm. far as creating. Um, some things take longer than others. 
but you can you know you can get there. Wow. Yeah, and I think that's that goes for every facet of life. Mm -hmm. you know, not just choreography and dance, but anything. Everything. Be vigilant, be fearless, and you know. There are no laws except mm -hmm. the ones we create for ourselves. Mm -hmm. Now I can dance a little mm -hmm. bit. I'm no like been to school and do <laughs> all and do all of that. But I love to dance. Maybe we can kind of. Well, I'm gonna teach you a little crazy in love. Really? Yeah. Let's do it. Go. Pop, pop, switch, switch, roll it up. There you go. Okay. There you go, lady. All right. One more. One more. Oh, one more. Here we go. Five, six, seven, eight. Pop, pop, switch, switch, roll it up. Yeah. Okay, so nice. that was crazy in love. Crazy in mm -hmm. love. What about um? Did you have you done any other pieces? Oh, um, I did Naughty Naughty Girl, Naughty Baby Boy, Baby Boy, Baby Boy, Naughty. Baby boy, stay on right. Boy. Um. What else? Um. Let's see. Can you remember any from that one? Baby Boy. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay, yeah, yeah, I think so. I think so. It's been a long time. Um, <laughs> so, oh yeah, go here, push, and push, and then now we're gonna we're gonna turn this way. Bop, 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 bop. Right. Okay. So, push, push, bop, da, 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 da. everybody, Tanae here with the Tanae Show, here with the lovely Miss Sunshine Anderson. Thank you. What's going Thank on? You. Oh, everything. <laughs> now, you are one of my favorites just because I see you around. I know that you're doing a lot, and I Thank congratulate you. you for that. Thank you. Now, I want to talk about the song, Done It All Before. That is still a classic. I heard it what all before. Went into, heard it all before. Yeah, yeah. What went into that? What went into that? Gosh, um, 15 years ago, um, a lot went into that, you know. Um, <laughs> There's a few of us in the room in California, you know, just got out to Cali, mm -hmm. um, you know, some good energy, some good vibes, um, you know, some old relationships and some drama from some old relationships. Yeah. There's about five of us in the room, five different writers on that record, so it's a big record. Big wow, record. and it is. I mean, it's still played to yeah. this day, yeah. and when it drops, I think everybody in the room yeah. knows the word. God is so. good. <laughs> yeah, God is definitely good. Mm. So you're in the community. You do a lot of things in the community. You was on the radio and doing stuff like that. So talk about how big it is now to kind of be tangible and people can actually see you and things of that nature? Um, you know, I've always been tangible. I think I've always, you know, told that line between, mm -hmm. um, you know, you're a superstar and, right. you know, the, I won't say regular, ain't nothing regular about me, <laughs> but the normal chick, you know. Right. Um, I am the girl that, you know, you might run into a stash house, <laughs> you know, um, you might run into a Blue Notes, you know. Right. Um, I've never been that um, Hollywood, <laughs> you know, say, for lack of yeah. better words, but um, I think it's very important, you know, for people to see you. Um, um, I've, I've never just been untouchable, mm -hmm. you know what I mean? I've never been untouchable, and I that's think that's what people thing. love about me, mm -hmm. is, is I always get, oh, I didn't know you were going to be so cool, mm -hmm. oh, I didn't know I was going to be able to come talk to you, so I'm the home girl. That is definitely a good thing, because I mean, we meet people, and some people mm -hmm. are more like the, and yeah. keep it moving, and it's just like... Your yeah. fans are your biggest supporters. Oh, yeah. oh, just yeah. like the Panthers say, they're the, the biggest supporters. Oh, yeah. So we, we need them. Oh, yeah. But I want to hear about what you got going on now. And yeah. are you still making music? You have any events for CI? Yeah. Well, um, I'm going to mess with you a little bit because they always say, well, where you been? And I'd be like, where y'all been? <laughs> Where y'all been? Where y'all been? Went nowhere, because huh? I've been working. <laughs> you know, um, sister is getting is getting it. No, seriously. Um, last year was a good a good year for me. Um, I teamed up with a good friend of mine, Mike Lighty. Um, you might be familiar with him, mm -hmm. Chris Lighty's younger brother, Violet right. Records, uh, Violet the Management. Excuse me. And um, yeah, you know, I'm I'm I'm. I'm I mean, you know, I ain't bragging or boasting or nothing, but a sister been working every weekend. Where y'all been? I mean, if it's you know, happening, go I got ahead. three albums on iTunes. Where y'all been? Um, go ahead and plug You know, those. I know where y'all been. Y'all been over there on the other side, and that's cool. <laughs> you know, but don't forget where music stems from. Right. R&B. But, um, 
Yeah, I'm here. Uh, I got a new single that's dropping uh, first the, the first of uh, first the first of second quarter. Okay. Uh, it's called Let Me Find Out. You know, I'm the mm. anthem chick. What is that so, about? So um, you know, you know, it's the anthem. Mm. Let me find out. Right. You run around the on there. Mm-hmm. Yes. Yeah. Let me find out. <laughs> Y'all didn't know what sunshine been at. Woo. Um, so yeah, you know, let me find out. Um, it's another anthem. Um, I'm really excited about it. You know, it's been what five years since my last album. Okay. Um, so yeah, we're working on that. Um, uh, I partnered with a health, a health and wellness company uh, last January, Total Life Changes. Um, yes. The company totally changed my life, you know. Um, wow. I was kind of, you know, sometimes bad things happen in your life. You know, the music industry can definitely take you up and down. Um, and sometimes you don't even realize that you're in a state of non-belief, you yeah. know. You pray and you're thinking, ooh, you know, I'm, 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 I'm prayed up, you mm-hmm. know. But, you know, really believing and I was just kind of wandering, you know, um, not really knowing what was next, praying, you know, for God to move in my life. And um, I got a phone call from a friend, you know, it was one of the best opportunities, that, you know, that I've had in a, in a, in a lifetime. Yeah. Um, and so I took it, and um, so now I'm, you know, helping others change their lives, you know, get their health back together, you know, lose some weight, mm-hmm. um, and making some good money. So and hit us, hit us sister up, lose five pounds in five days. Hey, <laughs> slim it on down. Please believe And you know what, I was going to ask you about that. My cousin is actually in Total Life Changes, yeah. and she, I, when I say every other week, Tanae, you got to get on this. Tanae, I'm, I'm listen, telling you, you got to get on this. Yeah, listen, I wouldn't, um, I wouldn't, you know, I wouldn't back a product, mm-hmm. um, you know, that I didn't, that I didn't believe in. Okay. Um, and, you know, um, more than, well, I won't say more than the product because the products are big, you know what I mean? Like I said, it's a health and wellness um, um, industry, you know, it's a, mm-hmm. it's, a, it's, a, it's a huge industry. You know, people are, are making a lot of money. You know, we, as women, we want to look good, you know what I mean? And so we've got something for everybody, you guys. But, um, yeah, you know, um, it, 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 it allows me to be the businesswoman, mm-hmm. you know, that I, I never really was, you know what I mean, yeah. in my music, you know, mm-hmm. a, a, a lack of, you know. But um, it allows me to be the businesswoman that I've never been. I get to uh, go into people's homes, you know what I mean, and reach out and touch mm-hmm. the people that, you know, I was untouchable right. before too, you know what I mean? And so um, it's, it's, and it's just been a great family. And that makes you look even more tangible when you yeah. being able to do that. So yeah. that's, a, that's a really good thing. Yeah. And I wanted to say, you know, I love the song. You ain't got a lot of kick out. I'm just here oh, to say, yeah. child, they still lying. <laughs> They, they still, still lying. <laughs> you ain't got a lot, Craig. They still yeah. lying. Wow. I swear, every time something go, I'm like, you know yeah. what? Let me let me go ahead. Well, you know, you real, you 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 real young. You ain't even supposed to know nothing about that. Shit. But uh, I appreciate that. That's that's they that's real. That's, that's real love. That's a fan right there. So Definitely. Thank you. Thank you. How how is it dating in this industry? Is it hard? Is it trying trying to kind of distinguish da- between dating? Who? Dating? Who, who does that? <laughs> no, I'm joking. I'm joking. <laughs> yes, it's very hard. <laughs> That's my point. Is yes, it's very hard. Sunshine is a single woman, you know. Um, now I that, think that, that really bothers me, though. Yeah. It's just it's so hard. Yeah. You know what I read the other day? What? They said Charlotte is one of the worst cities of dating. Have you seen that? You know, let's talk about how I googled the top the top ten cities of single men. Houston oh. was number three. Really? Yeah, I, I actually could not consider. Well, when trip. I say consider, right, you know, make a trip, right? You know what I mean? I said, ask my girlfriend, do you move to a city where you don't know nobody hoping you'll yes. find a man? Yes. No, but um, <laughs> you know, um, it's 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 it's. I think that, and, and I don't like to use this word because um, I want I want to be very clear about where I stand. But I mm-hmm. think that sometimes um, um, men are intimidated. Yes. You know what I mean? I've had them tell me, "Oh, you're so," and I'm like, mm-hmm. "Me though, mm-hmm. <laughs> dude." Not me, yeah. you know what I'm saying? Making Ain't nothing moves. intimidating, right? Mm-hmm. About me, but um, I think that you know some men are intimidated. Um, but but fellas, just be clear that you know there are still some women um, that know their roles. You know, I might talk a lot of can I cuss? I might talk a lot of shit. Um, you know, and I mean every day. No, but um, you know. Um, it is. It's just very it's hard. hard. You know, it's, it's very hard. hard. You know, and then we live in a world. You know, things are just different. Now. They are different, yeah, to say the least. Different. The females are different. Things are and a lot different. Yeah. yeah so. You know, and so um, you know, we're working on that. Mm-hmm. Yeah. <laughs> she said we're working on that. <laughs> so what do you have going on for CIAA? You got anything um, going on? I'm actually going to be at Wild Wings Cafe at the Epicenter on Thursday night. Okay. Um, and I am going to be at Cocktails in the City with L um, um, at LVJ. Um, um, uh, Lavandra Johnson, I know you guys are familiar with her. Yeah. She has a, a, an amazing boutique over at Ayersley. Um, but we're doing cocktails in the city um, at 1801. 
um, no try on. Okay. It's gonna be a Come really out. big event, a great, a lot of vendors, you guys, a lot of great stuff. We're gonna have some fun. We're gonna be dressed to the nines <laughs> and meeting the ladies, you know. And um, if you didn't get this dress, please get it. She oh yes, definitely. You, listen, you know, my man with the camera knows. Shout out to Kimberly's Boutique. <laughs> I love you, baby. You keep me so fly. Make sure you guys check her out um, on Park Avenue um, by, by Power 98. Ooh. So yeah, that's my girl. She keeps me fly. Now, what do you do for fun in the city? I mean. Oh, what do I do for fun in the city? Listen, again, you know, I'm, I'm, listening to I'm the home girl. You know what I mean? So, okay. you know, I, I, I was born in Winston-Salem. Um, I've lived in Charlotte. I've moved, we moved to Charlotte in 1981. I went to junior high. I went to elementary school here. This is my home. So, you know, my friends are here. So, you know, when somebody calls and says, hey, it's a fight party, mm -hmm. you know, or, hey, you there. Uh, we, we bubbling in bubble on Sunday nights. Panther Nation, baby. Yeah. Um, you know, um, I, I hang out every now and then. I have an eight-year-old daughter, um, so we, we do a lot of fun stuff together. You know, I'm, I'm a family chick, too. So. Well, that's always a good thing. Yeah. Like I said, y'all, look out for her. She's Very too. sweet, pretty person. Thank you. And we want to know about these events and everything coming up, because I'm going to come support you. Yes, please Definitely. do. Please do. I'll make sure you get one of my cards before you leave. Okay, please. The pleasure was mine. The pleasure was mine, and please plug your social media. Oh, you guys, please hit me up. Um, I'm an IG chick, okay? So hit me <laughs> up on Instagram at I am Sunshine Anderson. Uh, you can hit me up on Twitter at Sunshine. You can go to SunshineAnderson.com. It will take you to my Facebook fan page. Um, and then, you know, you can check out that Lose Five Pounds in Five Days, baby, Sunny T. Anderson on Facebook. I love you guys. Thank Honey, you for is going on me with this, going with me on this journey for the next Look, 15 like years. Like Kenya, fly with the wind, honey. <laughs> <laughs> we out. <laughs> Thank you so much. Well, thank that was you. Fun. Thank you. I want to Hello, and welcome to Goody Rec. My name is Carmen Howell, and my business partner, Bronte Mowbray, is not able to be here today, but she's actually the guru behind a great product that we have here for our customers. We have a great assortment of quality waist trainers and cinchers. If you look around here, we have vibrant colors, we have all sorts of animal prints, patterns. This one is my favorite. I call this the money maker. We have the money maker. And then we also have an assortment of great colors that are really good for sports training. Which, by the way, Bronte has actually come up with the signature name of Wasted Chicks. So why the Wasted Chicks Waist Trainers from Goody Rag? Well, there are several out on the market, but I've heard several times that it's a different quality that the ladies have with the waist centers. You have great quality. The majority of our waist trainers and centers have a latex outing. The inside, which is very comfortable, is a combination of cotton and spandex. And you have choices, okay? You either can go with a zipper, and we also have the double zipper, as well as a triple zipper. And this particular one here is actually my favorite. This is actually the waist uh, trainer that I actually um, wore and actually lost almost five inches from my waist. And I'm gonna actually show you what I, what I have on. And this particular waist center is actually a combination of the, the eye and hook as well as the zippers. So you're gonna get the double compression and the benefit so whether or not you're, you know, on an outing for that special outfit, these are the trainers that you want to get. We also have the vests that have the adjustable straps, okay? You can either get the hook and eye or you can get the zipper with the actual adjustable straps, which is very, very convenient as well. We also have our waist trainers that actually are great back supporters. They support your back really well, and that's one of the things that the vests and the weight trainers and centers are known for, is that they do give you great support. And men, we have something for you as well. We also have the waist, uh, the vest for our men. As a matter of fact, this is for the men. This is for the women. Notice the difference is that the women has a lower cut, but with the men, we have a cut that's appropriate for your chest size. You're going to get that great compression and you're gonna get superior, superior back support. Heard that a lot as well. Also for our men, we also have the uh, 
I call this one, this is the tummy cincher, okay? So it's sort of like a, a t-shirt um, as well, but you actually have, you know, the material with the spandex uh, in combination with the cotton that's actually going to help with that compression to bring that um, posture in and make you look uh, even better than you already look. And then for those who work out, we have great vibrant colors for those who work out. As you see here, we have a, a beautiful royal blue, uh, a pink fuchsia, as well as a purple. And then if you want to get even sassier in terms of the assortment that you have with Goodie Rack, you can also go with the $100 bill, or the million dollar, I like to call it, uh, waist trainer and cinchers. You can contact us at sales at goodyrack.com that's email sales.goodyrack.com or go to our website which is www.goodyrack and that's g-o-o-d-i-e rack.com and you can find this great assortment of waist trainers and cinchers and also we do have some butt lifters as well so you can check those out on our website also so order that, that waist center and get that immediate gratification like I did. Very, very comfortable, very rewarding. And if you're going out, put that weight, waist trainer or waist center on and put it on and get that instant uh, two to maybe three inches off of your waist. Or again, you have the back support that you can also benefit from the Goody Rack Wasted Chicks Waist Trainers. You can't go wrong. So happy to be here in the Charlotte area. But you can also go online to order www.goodyrack.com. Also, if you're in the Charlotte area, we do make house calls or do a, par a private party. If you're having a private party, you can contact us at sales at goodyrack.com. The email is below. Just email us and we'll get back to you as soon as possible. So again, if you're in the Charlotte area, we can come to your home, invite the ladies over, and we can do a private party just for you. You, you, you can't go wrong. It's nothing like putting on that waist center under your outfit and adding the sexiness, the confidence, because it definitely pulls in your torso and make you stand up straight and give you that great posture. You can't go wrong with GoodyRack.com. We're here for you. Again, it's www.goodyrack, that's G-O-O-D-I-E, rack.com. And email us at sales at goodyrack.com. It should be appearing right below your screen. Past the infatuation, can't lose. 